Hello everyone, welcome in. I'm Matt Seneca with PJ Tube, and I'm here with Robert Puckett. Robert, Robert is a territory manager with PJ Tube, and also a competitive shooter at the USPSA. Can you explain what that is and kind of how you got into that? Yes, USPSA is the United States Practical Shooting Association. It is action pistol by uh, how people know, you know, usually will associate with it. Uh, I actually got started in that about mm, 2014 through Craig Brunner, yeah. who, uh, another PJ2 uh, guy, and he got me started in that. I was a bench rest shooter at it before that, competitive shooting. I've been shooting competitively now for probably off and on 30 years. So. Oh, okay. so yes, I but I enjoy USPSA the most. All right, so. well that's very cool. And, and then, so the actual, when you're actually doing it, is it kind of like a um, like a course set up? Uh, yes, and then yeah, it's like, it's like a course. We'll have barricades set up, we'll have different uh, uh, obstacles that you know, we have to negotiate while we're shooting per se, you know. Uh, we have low ports, high ports, uh, uh, swingers and drop turner type targets and things like that, movers and things. Cool. So you have to think while you're moving. Right. You know, you're under time and stress to be able to react quickly if something goes on. Uh, so, you know, it's, it's, a, it's a fun sport. It, it, you know, it's good to compete. I think competition's good. Mm -hmm. I think when people compete, they, it helps keep them young, so to speak. Sure. And it keeps yeah. your mind sharp. Absolutely. You have to be able to think on the move very quickly. So, yeah. and then so there's there's rankings to them as well. Huh? Yes. Yeah. yeah. You, you, it, it's it starts off as unclassified and it goes D C, uh, uh, B A master grandmaster. Okay. I am uh, uh, a class shooter nice. in air carry optics division and uh, limited division both. So, so master shooter then is that is that something achievable? Yes. Yes, it is. Yeah. Um, uh, I. My goal is to make master this year and shoot nice. in the USPSA Nationals in uh, Frostbite, Florida in, in uh, October. Actually. Oh man! So, so another about a year down yeah, the road. Yeah, another ten months or so. Yeah. All right. So, well, good luck with that. That, that yeah. sounds like well, that sounds like you could do it, and probably <laughs> quite the challenge and, it, and it an accomplishment as well. So. It's all the above. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. All right, we got one more portion <clears throat> of this. These are kind of fun, would you rather type questions. Okay. So go ahead and pick one of those. They're not hard. I'll, uh, I'll read it for you. Oh, well, this, is, this one's pretty interesting. If you could time travel, when would you go? It would actually, I would like to do it in two different ways. One, I would like to go in the past, um, and I would like to go in the past, uh, really, towards the Revolutionary War, okay. when the country started. I would like to be part of that in that era. But the other side of me wants me to go to the future. Okay. I, love, I love technology. Right. I love technology. I, I, I love anything about space, you know. Uh, I, I love, uh, I used to do a lot of, you know, amateur astronomy and stuff mm. when I was younger. Um, so space is hugely fascinating to me. So I would love to go into the future to see where we're at as far as space travel and right. things of that what nature. What we explored. And yeah, we exactly. Yeah, right. Exactly. Have, That's a good answer. Did we go to Mars? Right. You know, what would it be like to be on Mars? Mm -hmm. I've often told my wife, you know, if they was taking volunteers, I would volunteer to go to Mars. You know, <laughs> nice. I know it's a one-way trip, but yeah, yeah. I would do it because there's something that that attracts me about that that yeah. unknown and exploration side of it. You know, I want to know. I'm a very curious person. So, all right, well, good answers yeah. on that one for sure. Thank you so much <laughs> Thank for your you. time. Thank you, uh, Robert Puckett, Territory Manager with PJ Tube, and stay tuned for the rest of our video series here to kind of pull the curtain back on the personal lives and hobbies of your coworkers and employees here at PJ Tube and Webco.